welcome back to the Bills Bunker. As always, I'm Jake Varko, and I'm here to discuss some signings that the Buffalo Bills made on Monday. They added a pair of players to their offensive unit. Duke Johnson and Jamison Crowder are reportedly joining the Buffalo Bills. First, they reportedly added seven-year NFL veteran running back Duke Johnson to their squad. Last season, Johnson posted 330 yards and three touchdowns on 71 rushes in just five games. Now, this might not sound like much, but he actually averaged 4.6 yards per carry with Miami last year. By now, we all know what happened with J.D. McKissick and the disappointment that the Buffalo Bills front office had after he elected to rejoin the Washington Commanders. Definitely a letdown for this front office, but they finally got their veteran running back to add more depth to the position. It was also reported that the Buffalo Bills are adding wide receiver Jamison Crowder on a one-year contract worth up to $4 million. Over his last 12 games, Crowder has accumulated 110 receptions for 1,146 yards and eight touchdowns. Bills fans have had quite a good look at Jamison Crowder. He's had two stints with the New York Jets, who's a division rival of the Bills. And he's also had a stint in Washington. But last year with the New York Jets, it's nice that the Bills are getting a receiver to add to their own arsenal. Adding a weapon to Josh Allen's impressive offensive arsenal of weapons. And they're also taking away a receiver from the New York Jets, weakening a division opponent. Crowder is a quick and shifty receiver. He's going to add to Allen's arsenal of offensive weapons and he's going to serve as a great replacement for Cole Beasley. We know what Jamison Crowder is capable of doing on offense, but there was a tweet that really piqued my interest from Sal Capaccio. And it reads, Although he hasn't really done it for a few years, Jamison Crowder has plenty of experience as a punt returner as well, returning 84 punts in his first three years in the league. I actually feel this is a really underrated and undervalued aspect of this signing. You need three components to win a football game. Special teams is one of them. Offense and defense are the others. Last season, you had Marquez Stevenson, Isaiah McKenzie, and Micah Hyde all took turns returning punts. Jamison Crowder is a quick, shifty guy. Really speedy. There's potential that we could see him competing as a punt returner next season as well. Not only will he impact the Buffalo Bills offense in a positive way, but... There's potential for him to have a positive impact on the special teams unit as well. I'm all for it. I feel that the Buffalo Bills made a couple solid additions to their offensive unit today. But I want to know how you feel about the signings in the comments section below. Let me know how you're feeling. Thank you for watching this video and stay tuned for more content coming your way. As I said before, we're in the midst of free agency season in the NFL and the NFL draft coming up as well. Stay tuned for more videos coming your way. I'm Jake Varko.